So this is new. Uh, let me see. Home page. I'm going to try and put it on my oh, computer. Yeah. So if anybody does come on. Oh, I wonder if I can do it on my phone too. I could see the chat and see if anyone comes in. So there's that. So here we are. I am going to. It says one person's watch. Oh, it's Audrey. Yay. Yay. Hi, Audrey. Thanks for coming. Woo. -hoo. So I just figured Tammy just went live. She told me to just go live and just show you all the stuff that I got at Disney World. The sticker being one of them, but I don't remember. Somebody gave us this. It was one of the restaurants. I think it was the Crystal, Crystal Palace, Palace when yes, we got when we got <laughs> yes butthole <laughs> effed by uh, that was that was after I should just tell the whole story the whole cluster fuck that was happening anyway. We went to the Crystal Palace after a very, very severe accident of me driving a scooter into a group of people. Babies screaming, ladies yelling, workers running, me screaming, can't stop, crunching under my tires. Then we made it to the Crystal Palace. They embarrassed us. And Audrey, just show her how it's done. Yeah. <laughs> so, anyway, when we finally made it to the Crystal Palace and got a seat, we were supposed to have dinner with Winnie the Pooh, Tigger, Eeyore, uh, Piglet. Oh, yes. They put these on the table for us. Welcome to our Friendship Day celebration. It wasn't a celebration. It was a disaster. Well, they all signed it anyway. Pre-signed because uh, Piglet fucked us off. <laughs> we never saw him. Uh, Pooh and Tigger were like trying to pull teeth. They finally came over. And Eeyore was standing in the kitchen with the food. At, it was a buffet. He was standing out there. He had to go to him like he was some kind of come to me. <laughs> Whatever. So that's where this <laughs> this lovely sticker came from. And I'm going to keep it. And everything is in a bag down here. Nothing's where it should be. So I'm just going to start. I'm going to pull stuff out and show it to you. And there's probably a story behind everything. These are here. So when we would walk into our hotel, it smelled really good. At first we were like, do we hate this? Yes, mass produced signatures. Exactly. So when we walk into the hotel, there was this smelling. It was almost like, do I love this or hate this? And then we kind of loved it. And then we were so sick of being there and so disgruntled. We kind of hated it. But then we decided we loved it. So <laughs> Tammy asked them, where, like, what is the smell? How could you get the smell? So the lady, whoever she asked, told her, oh, it's a 50th anniversary special candle that you can only get at Disney Springs. I asked Two people. She asked two people, and the, they told her. The shop person and the concierge. And they both told her it was a special candle, and you could only get it at Disney Springs. 50th anniversary candle. So, we ended up at Disney Springs. Well, we were there once because we tried. <laughs> we canceled our first Very Merry Christmas party and said we were sick, so they made us go all the way to Disney Springs to talk to... Um, I'm going to tell you what the fragrance is in a second. It's called Inspire. So, they made us go to Disney Springs to get our money back for the Christmas party, like they were doing us a favor. So then we had a day that we were going to Disney Springs because we were going to see Cirque du Soleil, which we <laughs> ended up canceling as well. Because we were donezo. So anyway, long story a little shorter. We go to... They told us the two stores that they probably sold this 50th candle into. So we went in there and we heard rumors that it was $50. So we went in there. 
me and Tammy parted ways. I was looking all over the 50th anniversary stuff. So I finally, I found this candle and I was like, mm, I don't know. I couldn't remember the smell because we're not in the hotels. So I was like, hi, Christy. Hey. So I asked the girl, I'm like, hey, do you have a 50th anniversary candle with the scents from the resorts? And the girl's like, a candle? No. She's like, I never heard of it. And I was like, are you kidding me? And she's like, well, what I do know is they use, it's called Bose Candles. And they are in either the co-op or there was another place. She's like, you could go in there and get, you know, it's the scent. So we were like, oh, okay. So anyway, we went in there and for $4 million, the name, it's Bose Signature Candles. And they are like a little kiosk for what we bit, if nothing. <laughs> So, so I wrote Disney Resort smell because I have so much of this crap. I was like, I'm writing it on here. I decided to get six wax melts, which I have one melting over there. And I got the um, essential oil or oil. I don't know if it's essential oil because it's it's diffuser oil. Okay, so Tammy told me that when the wax starts getting stale or not smelling anymore, to put a drop of this in there, and it'll work. So we plugged it in yesterday, and it does smell good. So that's Bose Signature Candles. In the, and you can get it online. And you can get it online. <laughs> and uh, it's called Inspire, and that's what they pump into the... Hotel lobbies. And it is expensive, but it's not $50. Yes, it's not $4 million. These were $12, and I have absolutely no idea how much. 18. This was $18? Yeah. Oh, my God. Okay, so this was $18. You could see how well I was watching my Unless money. Unless you bought was. three or more, and then they were $16. How many did you buy? Three. Oh, my God. She bought a diffuser to go with hers, too, though. All right, what other random stuff? I'm, like I said, everything's all over the place, and I'm just going with stuff that's on my desk right now. So, while we were at Disney Springs getting our money back the first time for the Christmas party, Tammy well, was looking... Supposedly. We were, supposedly. <laughs> they said maybe four to six weeks. Uh, Drake Shaw, is it cinnamony? No. no, it's... Ooh, I don't know if it's floral, florally. It's not sweet. It's... It's hard to describe. Yeah, I'm not good at this one. It's not cinnamony at all. It's more... I would say if fruity and flowery mixed together. Yes, and fresh. I mean, and, it's yeah, it's just a pleasant smell. Yes. So, while she was looking, we got lost. We were... We were mother that day when we were there so anyway when she was looking for whatever she saw joe malone i never heard of it before and she said she had this perfume on her wish list so we we're like well we'll stop in there and then we were so mad but i told her maybe if you go in the perfume place It'll make you feel better. And then I said, well, we're getting a ton of money back because we're not going to this party. So just go get your perfume. So I ended up with perfume too. And it's Joe Malone, London. Never heard of it. I chose Red Roses Cologne. And this was what? One ounce? I think so. One gram? One ounce, I think. I think it's an ounce. How much it was looks this? Like it's more than an ounce, yeah, it looks like a lot. I'll never use this in my entire life, the entirety of this thing. How much was this? 80 bucks? Yeah. So it was $80. Unnecessary and frivolous, but. <laughs> but supposedly we're going to get money. Wonderful. Back yeah, and we're supposed to get all this money back. We might. Oh, I still money. love it. it. Smells just like roses. So we spent the money we're getting back about 40 times in between there. So. <laughs> That's the Joe Malone 
<laughs> it's true. She's laughing, spitting out coca. <laughs> but we did. So that's the Joe Malone perfume. Oh my god. Uh. Oh, I got this. This is the super cutest thing. So it's. Oh, I can't make this smaller. This is what I get. <laughs> this is what you get. This is what you you're get. Live, so. Baby. Oh, you can't do anything when you're live. Mm -mm. Oh, well, that's a bunch of... You could bring it closer with the tripod. I'm not fucking with that. <laughs> so anyway, this is a little planner type thing. A ghost will follow you home. It's a haunted mansion. And yeah, I'll show you the price tag. Nothing's cheap there. It was $30, bucks, 29 99 So it's really cool. It has a snap. Call in the spirits wherever they're at. And inside... It has a pen over here with little eyes. It has three clips of the guys, those heads, not heads, busts. It has stickers. Uh, I'm gonna show them to you like this because obviously I can't move the camera, but they're really cute. You know, just anything with the sticker in it, of course I'm gonna <laughs> say, sure, why not? And I didn't see it, or I probably would have had Yeah, it she didn't see it. I bought this on the sly, and she's probably better off. But you had to see the way I was wrestling with these kids, you know, busting through. So all the pages have the same lady. Harp. Uh, that looks like a bell and a trumpet. Whatever that is. And the lady that's in the... Pistachio. Hi, I came over from Tammy's feed. First thing I see is a disclaimer. This video may be inappropriate for some <laughs> viewers. Proceed. F and A, let's go. That's fucking right. I, I I'm not I'm not Tammy. <laughs> I keep it real. She she's uh G rated. I'm what's that? Your X yeah, what's it? Um, NC-17 or whatever oh, it was. No. I think you're 18. Mature, whatever. <laughs> so that's that planner. I bought a pin. Pretty. Disney World Resorts. That is pretty. It's I don't pretty. think I saw that until just a minute ago when I sat up there to do my No, because you asked me in the hotel about it. And I bought these two things, Audrey. I thought it was cute, too. Uh, I bought us Tweedledee and Tweedledum, and I didn't know which one was which. I liked him better, so I gave her that one, and... We're pretty sure she has Tweedledum. No, we're <laughs> not. I looked it up. Uh-uh. Yeah. Uh -uh. <laughs> I, looked, I looked it up afterwards. Gotta have a badge or a fridge magnet. You know what? I looked at magnets all over the place, and I just couldn't do it. There were some I, I wanted just... to, but I was like, nah. I know. They did have some cute ones, but man... So I got Tweedledee, and she has Tweedledum, and those are going to be our trip things. $20 for a freaking magnet. So, uh, oh my God, at Epcot in Japan, you know, Japanese state. Wait, did I get this in China? I got it in some fucking Asian country. I don't know where it was. <laughs> it was either, I think I got it in China, because then we hit up the Japanese. I didn't buy yeah, anything didn't in the Japanese anything, one. Which was amazing. I know. I wanted everything in there, but so in China, China, <laughs> I got these two pens. So cute. They're really small little tips on them. So they're cute. Uh, we got about a billion of these reusable bags, small, medium, large. Those were the best deal of Disney. Yeah, they were the cheapest thing you could buy in that Disney. That was the small one? That was a dollar. This, yeah, it was a dollar. It's the small one. So we ended up with like a thousand of these. Um, they packed this in this cup. So funny story. We were like, we were at Starbucks inside Disney and we're like, oh, we're going to get a cup. And so I, she had... Two picked out but I saw this one. I'm like, I think I'm going to get this one. 
So she went her way, and I was getting mine, and I said, I was like, hey, can I uh, get my drink in here? And the guy's like, yeah, no. You can't use glass in Starbucks, so why on earth would they sell glass fucking coffee cups? Anyway, it's cute. It's glass. It has Mickey Animal Kingdom. Tammy, are you going to mail your goodies home? No, I think I'm going to, uh, I brought an extra suitcase. So I have an extra suitcase to bring it all. And I put it all in there and I think it all fits. So I think I'm good. So this is uh, Animal Kingdom, Mickey, Safari, Tree of Life, ceramic, glass, whatever. Then it has the sippy lid that you can rotate. So that's cup one. And I'm laughing because I think I only bought two cups and Tammy, I'll let her do her own haul if she's going to. I will do my haul, but I'm not going to do it till I get to Indiana just because I don't want to unpack everything. It's none of my business. <laughs> and I, business. I got this Magic Kingdom. This one's metal. But it's Magic Kingdom, Walt Disney World, and it has the map of the whole Magic Kingdom on there. Not that I want to remember. <laughs> so it was a shit show when we went the first day of Magic Kingdom, and we didn't want to go back until a different day, and we were supposed to go back like twice. So I canceled the reservations because you have to make reservations to go to a park now. So I canceled the reservations, and then we couldn't get back in there. <laughs> it was full every day, and I didn't care. No, we didn't. I was going to say we didn't give up. So the inside's metal. That's cute. So there's that. Uh, let's see. Oh, this is more Asian stuff, I think. Oh, no, this is all a bunch of mishmash. But, yeah, some of this is Asian. So I got this little... Geisha girl. Geisha girl. She's wooden. She's like a... I didn't see that. Chinese... Yeah, remember I didn't want to unwrap it? So now you can see it. <laughs> but funnily... Funnily? Funnily. <laughs> that's Funny daft. Selling ceramic cups. Yeah, right? Unreal. So anyway, she's like wooden. She's cute. I'll find a home for her. I love that word. We should use that. <laughs> I'll set her up there. And this is a chopstick holder. It's ceramic or porcelain. I don't know what it is. But it's a chopstick holder. But it's a cat. And I liked it. But I guess when you're using your chopsticks, you... Cute. Set them like that. So. How much was that? That looks like it was cheap. Four ninety five. Not really. I thought it said nine ninety seven. Oh, I, I did you find anything much. in Disney World that was ninety nine cents? Just that bag. That was a <laughs> yes. dollar. So, this I thought was super cute. It's a keychain, but it'll never get used as a keychain. I have hooks everywhere that I hang stuff from. And I didn't know what this cat was from. He was super cute. So I walked around a store asking people where he was from. And I finally found out that he is, or she, I don't know what it is. Oh, there's a person on the back. Oh my goodness. Disney Pixar. Oh, there's a girl on the back too. <laughs> anyway, it's from... Red Fox or Red... Turning Red. I haven't watched it yet, but that's what that's from. That's cute. I've never got the hang of using a set of chopsticks. I me mean, either. When there's forks invented and spoons, I don't see any reason why. I like using them when I eat sushi. Extra. It's fun. So in Germany, I had to get Mickey, who I'm going to have to easily or slowly do this because... He, I can't do it. I'll do it this way. He is wearing lederhosen. Stop <laughs> it. Is that the cutest thing? 
So for my German part of the family. Oh, yeah, that looks cute. Leader Hosen. Look at it, it's all hiding. <laughs> Super cute. I had to have them. I wasn't going to buy anything like this, but when I saw him in these. We also ate in Germany. Oh, yeah, we ate in Germany. It was horrible. <laughs> it was really bad. Oh. Oh, I've seen Turning Red. Granddaughter put it on for me when I was down watching her a couple Saturdays ago. Aww. It looks really cute. My friend told me to watch it, and I haven't. Was it good? And was that Katie? Is she? I think she's your only granddaughter, right? <laughs> Katie's awesome. I love her. Here's Ratatouille. I hate rats. I hate rodents. This ride was amazing. And we watched the movie while we were there. I never saw it, and I love it. So these... <laughs> so stupid because I have another one <laughs> and I didn't know what it was until somebody, I think we saw somebody with them and I was like, why did this cost so much money? Well, the one I bought in the first place was Orange Bird and I was like, why did this cost so much? Because it just, so I found out it's a shoulder plush and what everybody does. So the thing is inside this one, I didn't rip it off. And what you do is you put... You put this little green thing under your shoulder. Under your shirt? Under your shirt, on your shoulder. Mm -hmm. And then you set him on top. And he just sits there. And it was super cute. Everyone had him. Well, not him. But I didn't see him. And so. look at these ridiculous CVS tags that they put on these. Oh, yeah. Things. Everything. They had hair scrunchies there. Every single thing you buy has this long-ass tag on it. The tag's longer than the scrunchie. So when I bought him, I didn't know what that shoulder thing was and then I was like what is this and then we found out so then everybody had Ratatouille Remy Remy right yeah Remy Remy so mm -hmm. we got it and we were wearing them like dorks but his bum is magnetized yep you're right so it says um my kept falling off but we wore them for a while oh they're cute they are cute. super cute and after watching the movie he's even more cute so, there's that. Um, I got two tins. Because I'm in it for saving stuff in the tins. They're just mints. Oh, they're shaped like the gang. Oh, cute. Showing smaller than actual size. How big are they? So, anyway. Yeah, it's a tin. And it's for the 50th anniversary. Super cute. And those were just a little bit less than $5, but it wasn't bad because I figure if you buy a tin of Altoids, they're compar comparable. Ratatouille is a good film. Yes, it is. Someone else. That can't be it. Is that no. it? No. I think that's it. I bought a t-shirt with Mickey on it. It says Walt Disney World. Glad I pulled that out of there because that needs to go in the laundry. So does that one. But I didn't get that one there. And then this was a cheap sweatshirt. Feels good to be home. And it has the castle. that I'm sorry it's my insulin yeah you need a magnifying glass to see the mints honest to god so I got that sweatshirt don't want to throw it in there and I got one more sweatshirt that is like a throwback it says Florida Walt Disney World and I'm going to have to creep it again because I can't move the camera. Opens October 71. Magic Kingdom. Yeah, I feel like I have more stuff. And then the sleeve says Walt Disney World. Oh, that's cute. I don't think I even noticed that. And there's nothing on the back. It's just a gray, like... What were they... It's a sweatshirt, but they call them, like... What are they calling these things? I don't 
I didn't know they were calling them. Not like Jersey. It wasn't jerseys. They were calling them something. I don't know. But it's like a sweatshirt. And honest, I that's all I got. It seemed like a whole lot more, but there's nothing else in this bag. That's weird. So I'm kind of impressed. I'm impressed. I thought I had a lot more stuff than that, and that was nothing. Oh, your phone case. Oh, but you can't show. Oh, yeah, I can't show my phone case because it's on my phone. So but it's Timon and Pumbaa. Yes, the and Simba. And Simba, yeah. From Lion King walking across the bridge. I remember, how far do I live from Orlando? Well, going there, it said an hour and 54 minutes, and coming home, it was like an hour and five minutes, so go figure. Somewhere in between? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe we were doing 100 coming home because we wanted to get out of there so bad. I'm not <laughs> sure. So ready to be there. I can't. Say that's not the case. <laughs> so, I don't know. That's all I have. I thought I had more. I thought this might go on longer. Where's your cup from the park? From the Oh, it's outside. Oh. It's a good place for it. Yeah, we had cups. You buy a cup in the resort for $500, and then you can fill it up the length of your stay. And it used to be you could have the cup for whatever... Oh, that's not bad. I drive that far from grocery. To, yeah, I used to, too. Just to go. Um. Anyway, what was I going to say? That you used to be able to fill the cups oh, up. Oh, you used to be able to fill the cups up, you know, whatever. Now, whatever they do to the cup and the pop machine, it tells, it gives you a date. This cup is good until, what was it, December 19th or I, I was going to say, I think I said the 19th, which doesn't yeah. make sense because it's still good for a week. Yeah. We could have kept going back there for a week. But how the hell does the cup? That's Big Brother Disney, just so you know. Just so you know. That's what they're doing. They know everything. And my magic band, that's on the car. Oh, it's a good yeah. place for it. But I couldn't stand it and took it off and threw it in the car. That is so ridiculous. Like a four cent Philip is going to break Disney. Exactly. Exactly. Crazy. Yeah, and the cup is about this big around. We did test it last night. A whole can of pop fit in it. But don't go looking to have a drink for a while because you have to keep going to fill it. So, I don't know. I guess that's it. I won't bore you anymore with... I'm looking around to see if there's anything else I... Like, put up or anything before. There's not. That's it. Wow, I'm impressed because I sure thought I had a lot more stuff. I guess that's why your bill was so much less than mine. Yeah. My bill was half her bill because third. you wear those uh, magic bands and you link it and you just pop, 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 pop. <laughs> you could buy whatever you want and square. Well, yeah, you could square up at the end. But that shit was coming out of our bank accounts. And then it said we owed all this money when we were checking out. Yeah, but Tammy always is extra and buys the whole lot. Yep. <laughs> it's been great chatting what? live with you both. <laughs> you know Tammy Passaggio. What? You've met her before. <laughs> All right, I'll let you go. Thank you so much for coming over and watching. It's been fun. Fun, 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 fun. <laughs> so thank you guys. Maybe I'll do this more often. It's been a good time. Yeah, it's and fun. it's easier this way. So, I will see you later, and thanks for watching. How do I shut this off? There's an X at the top. Oh, okay. Right Bye. Bye. Are you sure you want to stop? Oh, yeah, I want to fucking stop. Why?